So today we are making hearty vegan spaghetti with tomato sauce, olive oil, sea salt, garlic powder, organic stevia, garlic paste, ketchup, and some whole grain pasta, mm, and fill roast hamburgers. That is what our meat is going to be for this spaghetti. This is the best meat alternative I have ever tasted. Everything else... You know, I could fool people who are not vegans with this and they have no idea that they're eating vegan meat replacements. So you just cut it up one way, turn it around, cut it the other way, and look at this, little chunks. It looks like meat. It is pretty close to meat as far as the taste and the texture. Then you're going to boil some water, break your noodles up into three. I like to do that because it's easier to eat in the end without super long noodles getting stuck in your throat. You're going to boil those until they're done, throw that olive oil in the pan, throw that field roast in there, throw it around because it's already done. You're just kind of heating it up and then you're going to add that garlic paste to it. That just gives it some more flavor, making your mmm, the mmm part to it. Then you're going to drain those noodles. Make sure you get all the water out when you drain your noodles because if you put water into that mixture, it is not going to taste seasoned and flavorful like it should. So you're going to dump those noodles in with the field roast that you've already been cooking for about five minutes in that pan and you're just stirring it all because it's all it's pretty much done you're like done now you're just kind of like mixing it up throwing that spaghetti sauce whatever brand you like i like the kind that costs 88 cents from walmart that's just the best flavor one for me from my experience and then you're going to put a little organic stevia this is not because we're sugar fiends but because it takes that bitter taste that sometimes tomatoes have off when you add a little sugar in there and then this is the garlic powder which i don't even think any came out i think it was near the end of that um i add a little black pepper that's again for flavor and then i also like to add my uh, sea salt here i don't think it was coming out at first so that shake it a little harder but yes um i love to have my food seasoned well so i just put all that in and stir it up real good make sure it's all evenly mixed up that is the key to it mix everything evenly or actually some people like to keep it separate but here i just looked at it like uh, not saucy enough add some ketchup and that really just takes the sauciness to another level, which is how I like my spaghetti. I like every inch of every noodle to be saucy. Then you're gonna put it in a bowl, mm, put some parsley on it, and bam, you have vegan spaghetti.